That's pretty amazing. And on ER, I got to ask, I mean, did you even work with George Clooney? Yeah. You yeah. did. The most amazing human being. How, how every long? Time, every time you mention his name or like, or I see him on something, I, I just smile. I'm just so happy for that man. He is truly one of the nicest superstars in the world. Nicest guy. He doesn't even have to be a superstar. What was He's it just, about him? Like when you're on set, what do you recall that you just remember him so vividly being so kind and nice? What was it about him? Everything. I mean, he is always just, I remember, I remember I had to do the Tonight Show and he was also a guest, you know, and you know how like, because he's the bigger star, they always have the bigger star first and then they leave. Right. Well, I was like ready to piss in my pants. I was so nervous because, uh, you know, I'm, I'm really more an introvert. I thought I was an extrovert, but I'm really not. <laughs> and so when this kind of stuff happens, I... I, I, I get very nervous. And so my publicist, uh, he apparently like knocked on George's door and told him that I was really, really nervous and was about to like just throw up and not go on. And so George, knowing that he stayed instead of leaving, like when I, he stayed what? the whole time on that set with me, just in case I, you know, like, he was just he's he just, stayed in the chair. He didn't leave as the lead yeah. guest yes. on the Tonight Show. You know, just like little subtle things like that that and he's done a million other things like on set. He's just Do you remember him being hunky on set? Sure. But I think he's hunkier now. You like the older George? I think so. Yeah. You do. Yeah. Yeah. I mean he was he was he was hot back then too. 